Hey guys, it's Lena from the Land of Gods and we are doing the monthly map spread for the sign of Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. This is for the month of September guys, but please remember time is fluid, energies can be reversed and of course this is a general reading. So the cards might pick up your energy or someone on your mind. So please take what resonates, leave the rest for others to receive. If you are here for the first time, welcome aboard, welcome to my channel. And if you've been kind enough to come back, welcome back guys. Thank you so much. Let us go Scorpios. Whoa, cards wanna talk. Where we are starting, Ace of Water, lot of love. Lot of love is from where we are starting. That's nice. That's lovely. Scorpio's last few months have been tough, but this is a very, very positive way of starting September. Eight of fire. Look at that. Exchange of beautiful words. There's a lot of warmth around. You guys are finally talking. Communication flow is beautiful. Seven of waters. You feel you have enough and more hangman where the hangman goes here why are you then doubting everything <laughs> why are you doubting it if you have such a wonderful flow if you have so much of love if you have so much of warmth around you if you have enough and more why are you like are you sure mm. are we jinxing ourselves or are we feeling that oh i hope i might not jinx myself both ways what are you doing attracting something something you are attracting is it positive for you to take a call on that question page of air Air is all about truth. Something is coming your way that is also bringing in some kind of news. I see six of waters from the past. Something you've been waiting for long to hear from, probably. There is some communication clearly coming in with that eight of wands and the page of air. Whoa. Am I? Yes, I'm, I am. Oh, okay. Messenger of water. Yeah, there is something that is coming face to face or you are coming face to face with. Clearly. King of earth. You are taking this very... How do I say? Maturely, yes, but hesitant you are in enjoying this love somehow there is a sense of hesitation you pulling yourself back as if if you enjoy yourself too much you're gonna jinx it nine of earth this could be a new proposal of sorts coming your way whether it's a new job or whether it's some kind of you know something new that you want to start professionally that is going to give you some sense of prosperity on your own this is money coming your way and you are taking it very coolly there is a sense of hush here like don't get too excited right now okay let's see what it is page of waters there is so much of love here there is but you are hesitant i don't know why you are strength yeah there is the sense of controlling your raw emotion like stay in control we got to be in control there is a sense of let's keep it a hush hush there is a sense of you know secrecy so to say queen of fire i do not know for how long you're gonna keep it under covers because we've got lots of fire here lots of fire your element 
and fire fire and water going hand in hand very very strange one more card spirit to close this cycle wow look at that hierophant hierophant beautiful way of closing it by the way learning either you are waiting to learn more i'm taken to that page of air for you to finally you know break the news to the world so to say but you definitely have this thing going and it's very fiery and it's gonna bring you quite a lot of strength but you are taking it very very calmly very you scorpio keeping everything under covers very secretive three of air we are letting go of something somebody is letting go of something yeah and you are trying to have all the things figured out before you crack the news before you tell the world that yeah by the way here it is i am taking that new beautiful beginning you are till that time keeping it under covers ace of water look ten of cups my god so much of love here this is something that is gonna bring you so much of abundance very much so this is happy times ahead eight of fire spirit please clarify eight of fire Okay, quite a bit here. We have the Three of Cups. Celebrations coming your way. Blessings coming your way with stars. And Eight of Wands is clarified by the Eight of Wands. There is a lot of warmth. There is a lot of talking happening. This feels very blessed energy. There is something going on. I feel there are two situations here. One is where lots of heart is involved. Lots of emotions are involved. You are at a happy place with your partner if you are with one if you are not well clearly some celebrations are happening where you might land up finding somebody you are at a spot in life energetically where you feel the energy flowing there is no stuck up feeling what you are thinking what you want you have that and more there are options around you and you are thinking about those options clearly six of cups as i said something from the past that's coming in probably there is something that you know you might have taken up in the past and then you forgot about it like you applied for uh, some job or you thought of taking up something new you thought about it and then it kind of went into the cold bag so to say for a while and now that energy is popping up again so you have what you are doing right now in hand and now this something from the past is coming up again giving the feeling of i have options around me of course you're thinking about it clearly you are giving it a good thought but here oh my god such beautiful beautiful energy love romance celebration warmth wonderful lots of hope there very positive energy i'm very happy for you scorpios last few months have been kind of crappy so this is a good feeling but maybe that is the reason you feel i should not jinx it you know let's not talk about it too soon page of pentacles lots of learning you're trying to learn that page of pentacles with that page of air at the same time with the hangman you're taking your time as i said there is a sense of hush let me think about it let me figure everything out before i tell everybody about this new potential that i'm taking that's the sense that i'm getting page of air let's see what is this page of air bringing in clarity ace of swords look this is what i'm saying you are waiting for certain nitty gritties to come your way there is something definitely in the pipeline you are definitely talking about this with someone and you are waiting for unraveling this uncovering this after having everything clear 
Where should I go? Where should I go? King of Pentacles is where should I go? Five of Pentacles. Look, there is whatever the sense of not enough, that's going away for sure. Because there is something from the past, as I said, something from what you thought might not really work. What you thought is, you know, kind of closed chapter. That chapter is opening up, bringing in the feeling of having more on the platter now. So the way you've been feeling lately that, you know, sense of lack, whether it is you not being appreciated as much as you should, whether it is, you know, you feeling you're not getting as much as you should, whether it is the appreciation, whether it is reward of any sorts, basically, monetarily, otherwise, that sense is leaving the scene somehow. Let us go to the messenger of water. Hermit, look, I'm telling you, you are whatever that you are going to face or whatever that is coming your way, you are going to deal with it. You are looking at all the pros and cons. You are very much looking straight at it. But at this point in time, there is a lot of, let me see what the negatives, positive pros and cons, a lot of weighing around contemplation going on. And you are keeping it to yourself. Hermit is a very isolatory energy that to along with the hangman right there whatever this new opportunity is you're keeping it to yourself at this point in time let's not jinx it page of waters with the knight of pentacles taking it supremely slow each step taken forward very carefully very very carefully nine of pentacles nine of pentacles spirit five of swords Probably I feel that once you unravel this or once somebody gets a clue or a hint of what's going on, it's not going to be an easy exit for you towards this, you know, prosperity, so to say, towards this new whatever. And probably that is the reason why you are trying to have this just ready for you, you know have your horse ready there is some kind of conflict that's going on that you want to free yourself from and probably that is the reason that you are now considering something from the past that you might not have considered or you might have you know just kind of closed doors on there is a conflict that is underlying energy that I feel there is that sense of I'm not getting enough and there is this clash so why am I doing this when I can have all of these beautiful things yeah you're opening doors for yourself Scorpios strength king of wands wow that is a lot of fire right there either you have fire in your chart or you are dealing with someone who has a lot of fire i see king of wands and queen of wands there is a lot of fireworks here whatever this new connection is whatever this new energy that is coming in it is coming in with a bang it is and it's actually giving you a lot of inner strength it makes you feel stronger worthy of what's coming up you know you feel that self-worth coming back in the forefront which you feel so far has not been respected or rewarded the way it should have hmm interesting queen of fire heart lit up your solar plexus lit up so much confidence eye on the target my god what a queen beautiful card that is spirit please clarify queen of fire here for my scorpios queen of swords coming in queen of swords coming in with the queen of fire oh my god what a combination so much fire 
and so much objectivity you're not taking shit from anybody you're like cut this crap okay you are not taking shit from anybody yeah 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 you are like shush 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 no uh uh don't give me this bs okay that is a big circle of learning about your own self about your self worth hierophant let us clarify hierophant coming up with the seven of swords yeah learning about something that's been happening behind your back there has been somebody who has invited this conflict it's not that you want this conflict you actually want to set yourself free from this conflict but there is some energy that works behind your back that works behind curtains there is somebody around you in your surrounding in your uh external environment who is a very yucky energy actually you know somebody like a backstabber somebody who always talk shit you know sweet when you talk to them but really really uh petty energy that i feel here very petty person whosoever this is and you've learned this and you are like you know not taking this shit anymore man god bless this petty energy when the queen of fire and the queen of swords energy is coming together they're going to burn their ass basically with the devil oh my god yeah you are you are getting the devil by its horns the only card that can defeat the devil is the strength and that stands there with the king of wands so much of determination you are ready to lock horns if need be to take this conflict you do not want to you already are looking for other options fixing that and then you're like you know what let's lock horns you want to lock horns let's go about it let's go outside no it's that energy because i see that there is something new coming up with a lot of abundance promised abundance and that door is clearly open there is a certain clarity there you are weighing those options that you have in hand and you're like you know what i am done with this stupid cycle where i am not being respected as much as i deserve i'm not getting as much as i deserve and when that happens though the conflict opens up you are burning these people to the ground oh wow <laughs> scorpios god bless those who are standing against you right now let us get you an oracle guidance message from the energy oracle deck spirit fifth chakra you are going to talk about this soon we have the throat chakra lit up fifth chakra archangel gabriel there is talks happening i'm telling you there is no stuck energy your energy flow is very 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 good it's just how you going to convey this whenever this energy comes to locking horns that conflict pops up let's read this self expression and speaking your truth gabriel holds his trumpet in one hand and a beautiful orb of blue light in the other he is sending powerful energy to your throat center acknowledging your power to communicate and your readiness to do so this angel opens you up to the truthful expression both with yourself and others yeah as i said communication is opening up there's something new that's bringing in a lot of hope and abundance and feeling of fulfillment you may have had the trouble with expressing emotion and ideas in the past but gabriel is here to tell you that your soul longs to take this leap now be aware that true communication includes how you speak to yourself so never deny your profound integral 
value which you feel earlier was not being valued and now you're like no -uh, i'm not taking that speak up for yourself write in your journal let your words flow now is the time to express yourself freely and fully and the universe always honors your choice to do so this card also indicate that a communication project is coming or a time of heightened communication with spirit and telepathy with others there you go loves reaffirming reconfirming everything that we have said so far scorpios all the very best for whatever this new beautiful beginning that is bringing so much of clarity and abundance and god bless those who are trying to be all fishy behind your back because they do not know what they are gonna you know confront when you are gonna confront them so god bless them god bless you on that note i'm gonna take your leave i thank you all for joining me it's a wrap namaste from the land of gods